The approach that I pioneered back in 2000 to defeating aging was and is a divide and conquer approach. It has many components to it. Basically, the way it works is that I divide the phenomenon of aging into seven different categories, each of which is a kind of type of damage that the body inflicts upon itself throughout life, and which eventually contributes to the ill health of old age, to the diseases and disabilities, and eventually death. And that means that in the time since that point, there has never been a single kind of wow moment, shall we say, a single moment in which I have felt that we've made some dramatic breakthrough. It's kind of in the nature of any divide and conquer strategy that you're making breakthroughs on each of the components all the time, but each breakthrough is only dependent for its impact on corresponding breakthroughs in the other components. And then in 2000, when I had this big eureka moment where I realized that the repair of damage could be comprehensive, which is something that had totally not been considered by gerontologists until that point, um, you know, then I re that was a real wow moment. But since that time, since it's a, a divide and conquer strategy, it's just a matter of balance, really. You know, the emphasis of what, of what we do, whether here in Ajax or in my nonprofit Sense Research Foundation is generally at the level of trying to catch up. In other words, trying to look at the hardest things, the things that are in danger of lagging behind, so that we don't end up in a situation where we've fixed most of aging, but people are still getting sick and dying on schedule because of the thing we haven't fixed.